Hi folks, let's talk more about data analysis. Data analysis can be overwhelming whether you are a data scientist, a business analyst or just someone who loves working with data. Therefore, in today's video, we will dive into number one of the best AI tools that can surely facilitate in data analysis. Now I introduce to you Julius AI. Okay, so without any delay, let's dive into exploring these AI tools. Now, let's start by discussing the first tools and it's called Julius AI. Okay, Julius AI has a user-friendly interface as you can see and the best part is that it generates Python code. Yes, you can see that at the top and it also generates R too. Okay, now Julius AI use like three models for data analysis. You can see that at the bottom, we have default, we have chat GPT 4, and we have Cloudy 3.5, okay? We use this for intensive research, we use this for deep research. Also, we have our tools, okay? In these tools, what it does is that this helps us to do some running Python in a secure sandbox, okay? We run Python code, spreadsheet analysis. We also have our search by the internet okay we use this to search for different kind of uh, of topic we really want to get deep into okay so we have the model chart okay we use that also for chatting directly with popular ai model okay we can disable it depending on what we want also we have advanced reasoning okay in this advanced reasoning julius ai allowed to create a plane for the tax and execute it depending on what we want, okay? We can enable it or disable it. So that's how it works. Now let's get into the analysis part of AI. First, you need to upload your file. Now we can do that from here. So when you click on it, we have upload file, we have Google Sheet and we have manage secrets. But here we are going to talk about upload file. So this allow us to upload different kind of file. Now let's get to it. I'm going to upload my file. So I'm going straight to my desktop and then I'm going to select my file and which is an Excel file. Then I click on open. Okay, as you can see, now it's uploaded and we have our columns, we have our rows, and then an error has been detected, which is our columns, okay? The name tag are not there. So you can see, so that's one good thing about Julius AI. Issue detected, okay? You can see that. So now he's talking about some issues. Please review or ignore. So we upload the first file. We can see there are errors. And then now let's upload the second file without error. So let's see how it works. Okay, so now I'm going to upload, um, what do I have here? Okay, let me work with um, Pizza Sales. Okay, I have this and then let's give it some seconds. So um, here we are, uh, we have our column, Pizza ID, we have our quantity, we have our unit price, everything we have here is set. And guess what the good news is? there's nothing like error in these data sets okay this is lovely okay we did the first one that comes with error and julius ai detected now this is the second files without error awesome so now let's analyze let's interact with julius ai now please okay please provide provide some insights okay some insights about the data okay as you can see from the data like i said we have our columns we have our this ai will automatically detect any issue within the spreadsheets remember and i said once the checking is over we can interact with the data and that is what we are doing now so let's click on search so let this AI give us some insight about this data. And this data is about PISA sales. Okay, let's check it out. 
okay this is the output based on the outcome i can provide some insight about the data okay let's scroll let's scroll so this is our data let's scroll down let's scroll down what else do we have wow this is it now the excel file contains a single sheet named pizza says that's right with data about pizza order that's good here is a brief overview of the data structure now let's check it out each row represents a single pizza order the column provides various details about each order that's right and here we are we have all the information we need pizza id unique identifier for each pizza order uh-huh and then we have various information here and then the data seems to be from a pizza sales business so in summary what this does it gives me a summary of what this data is all about okay is all about and now let's talk about some few let's add some few information let's talk about okay um give me the revenue okay give me the revenue of the pizza sales revenue of the pizza sales okay and let's execute it okay awesome give me the revenue of the pizza sales and when we calculate the total revenue from the pizza sales data here is the code now let's scroll down i told you julius ai is the best to analyze okay so now let's give it some seconds it's going to do the calculation wow awesome that is it now let's scroll up we have it here we have it here now we have okay this is it the top 10 pizza by revenue this is it wow so you can see we have the thai chicken pizza we have the barbecue chicken pizza and this we have in the spreadsheet so what it means is that the revenue per each pizza which is the top 10 is what we have as a visualization right here okay so julius ai is just so awesome when it comes to analysis as a data analyst we know the importance of visualization so julius ai generates various charts and graphs in a single click of button okay and that is exactly what we are experiencing right now